Hey, I'm Ted Vieira, and the EVF on Fuji's X-T1, right? <laughs> I know I've talked about this feature before and how much I love it, because when uh, you look through this viewfinder, you get a preview of your exposure, your depth of field, uh, the film simulation, your white balance. Man, you get your photo before you've taken the shot, and how cool is that? Um, that has saved me so much time in post, in editing. Uh, that has saved me so much time in front of the computer because I can get the shot in camera because I can see it. Or I can get it 80 to 90% of the way there and then just do a few minor tweaks in post to get what I want. And a huge time saver. That feature alone has really solidified my relationship with this camera. Um, I would hate to lose that. Now, as cool as that preview is, what are you going to do if you're going to do a low light shoot, really moody stuff, right? Where your background is low light, your foreground is low light, but you and you're just you're just lighting your model or your subject with uh, one speed light, one flash. So what you do is you you set your exposure and your camera for your background, and you get your flash into place, you get your model into place, and look at the viewfinder, and man. You can't see anything. It's dark. The light's not there. It's not going to be there. You haven't pressed the button yet. You can't see what your model's doing. There's no more visual communication through the viewfinder anymore. You can't see what she's doing. You can't see her facial expression. You can't even see if her eyes are open. Um, it's just dark, man. <laughs> right? So, you know, the very first photo shoot I did with the X-T1 after I got it was exactly like that. I wanted. I was working with Geneva. And we wanted to create uh, kind of that classic Hollywood lighting, very selective lighting. The dark, a background would be dark, and she would just be beautifully lit. Uh, just gorgeous stuff. I love that kind of lighting. And so, um, also when I, this was the first shoot with the X-T1, and also it was the first shoot where I was using this light modifier from MagMod. Um, these guys are awesome. Man, they're, uh, their light modifiers really give you that awesome control over your light. And uh, I did a video on, on their stuff uh, a few videos back, if you want to check it out. But um, so if I got that preview of that dark shot, not, a, not able to see, I wasn't able to see Geneva, what her expression was, um, this was not going to work. But now luckily Fuji has made a very practical option to where you can turn those previews off. You can turn your exposure preview off in the viewfinder and you can turn your white balance off in the uh, preview, off in the viewfinder. So if you can turn those off, then basically when you're looking through the glass, you're seeing just, you know, basically you'd be seeing just like as if you were looking at the person without the camera, with those dark exposure settings in front of your face. You would just see the person just as if they were just sitting in the room in front of you. So I can now see Geneva. I can see that her expression. I can see when it's a right moment to get that shot that's going to be awesome, with that awesome lighting, this beautiful woman, and a great shot. <laughs> Being able to turn off that preview is what made that happen. So that's a very cool, and like I said, just a very practical way to get around that. A lot of you guys probably already know this, so maybe it's a small group. But man, if you didn't know this, this it's, a, it's cool. You can just go into your menu system, turn your previews off. Um, and how you do that is you just, I don't know if you can see this very well. Hey, at least the video's not backwards this time, right? <laughs> okay. Um, you can just go in, go into your menu system. Uh, the red tabs and the blue tabs. The red tabs are your shooting tabs, uh, shooting menus. The blue tabs are your uh, setup menus. So you want to go down to setup menu number one, the blue first blue tab. Just scroll down. Oh, whoops. Actually, first you got to go over because you're automatically in shooting menu one. So now scroll down to setup menu number one, the first blue tab. And if you go into that menu, you'll see your very bottom option on the XT1 is says screen setup. So you want to tab down to that screen setup and go into that. Now your third option down in the screen setup menu says it's for your preview. Uh, exposure and white balance preview. So go down to the third option and select that. Now by default, um, the preview is set to go ahead and show your exposure and your white balance preview. The second option 
um, you can just turn the you can just have white balance preview only. So you can turn the exposure preview off, just white balance. The third option down turns all, <laughs> the white balance and the exposure preview off. So you're getting that just real clear representation through the viewfinder of the person sitting in front of you with no light on them. That's awesome. I love that so much. And uh, it's I, I even assigned this feature to the uh, front function button of the camera because I love to be able to go back and forth during shoots if I want to turn those previews on or off. It's awesome. Um, I'm Ted Vieira, and I hope this was of some help to you. If uh, you have any questions, just let me know and I'll answer anything I can, and I will see you in the next video. Okay, thanks.